Um, okay, so tell me something that I want to. How'd you make this taste so good? What is in there? Magic unicorns Come, and stars. You won't tell that. <laughs> Come on. No, honestly, it's actually natural flavors. So it's sweetened with stevia, and then there's natural berry and citrus flavor in there just to help give it the the love that it needs to go down. Yeah, but and so it's stevia that makes it taste good. It's that's, that's the sweetness. sweet part. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And stevia won't spike your insulin or anything like that, correct? It does not. No, it helps uh, actually with blood sugar regulation. Yeah. And so diabetics can take it. Anybody can take it. If you're keto, you can take it. Um, yep. And then the collagen protein. Uh, if someone's fasting, well, I that's a bad question because I wouldn't take collagen. At Yeah, I'm wondering that. Could they take collagen if they're in a fast or is that going to throw them off? Uh, it depends on the person and it depends yeah. on their sensitivity levels and how much. So right. most of the fasting signals will be triggered by either significant amounts of protein or even small amounts of sugar. Um, some people can get through their fast with a little bit of fr- protein and certain amounts of fat without there being any of those metabolic triggers to come out of your fasting state. So I'd say if you're really new to intermittent fasting and you're trying to get your body into that rhythm and get your insulin sensitivity and all all of those metabolic processes really on board, maybe not the best move for you to use. But if you've been doing, you know, fasting and you've got your eating window dialed in and you've been doing that for a long time, having a little bit of collagen outside of that eating window is not going to throw you out of your fasting state. I, I swear by collagen. I don't miss it. And I'm now becoming like addicted. And uh, I every morning I take collagen every night. Now I take third Z. Um, awesome. Can can you? What would happen if you took third Z during the daytime? Would that affect you at all negatively? Like, you know, cause you're trying to sleep and calm down and, or is it, you, that's a nighttime thing only. So that's such a great question. I've actually had uh, customers message me and be like, Hey, I've been using this a little bit off label. Is that okay? Including my mom, by the way, who <laughs> <laughs> like literally like a few months after we launched, she messaged me and she's like, I think you should really start to market this for daytime use when people are anxious or overstimulated because she uh, uses it when she's not- getting to feel like it's too much. Um, and because it doesn't have any sedatives in it, it's not going to knock you out. So it will help you like come down from that overstimulated feeling uh, if you're there and it's not going to keep you from like doing your work or anything. You're just going to feel a little bit more chilled out, a little kind of winded down from where you were. I, I just realized this is going to be my new pre airplane uh, drink when I awesome. fly. <laughs> yeah, because I don't like to drug on planes like everyone else does. And Mm -hmm. my friend's a flight attendant and she said they think something like on a long haul flight, like 60 percent of the people are drugged. And uh, I've just never wanted to do that. And I I don't like to be in that state of mind, but I do like to relax. So, yeah, um, I think I'm going to do that. That's going to be my new thing, especially red eyes and. Can I yeah. tell you, we're working on a, a daytime product and we're calling it Relax Snacks. I had literally <laughs> have not said this publicly before, and it's specifically for you heard it here use cases on like the that. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. That's Big awesome. reveal. Where, where can people get Third Z? Uh, they can get it through our website at thirdz.com. Okay. I think we have a code too, so use our code. Um, yeah. Thank you, Justine. Thanks for coming on the show. I appreciate it. I wanted to clear all this up because I talk about it all the time. I talk about how I take it. Uh, and I always feel like I'm not an expert on it. And as much as I love it and feel good, like my friends kind of trust me and they're like, <laughs> okay, if you do it, I'll do it. But like, you know, like they're like, you kind of, I do my research on all my, all my supplements. And mm-hmm. I, I, I have a friend who just told me that I, um, I've, He's like, I'm going to have to put another mortgage on my house because you have me taking all these different things. Um, but I made it's him a good throw investment, out his, though. I made him throw out his curcumin. I was like going through his kitchen. I'm like, this doesn't have peppering in it. Get rid of it. <laughs> so I'm a little bit of a nerd on this stuff, but I wanted somebody who knew more than I did. So thank you for clearing up all that stuff. Um, I swear by the stuff. I think it's amazing. I think it's uh, I've just felt a lot better. It was so funny how last night we both sat down and we're like, third Z right now. This, <laughs> it's tough. It used to be Love like, it. okay, make me a, uh, make me a, a tequila and soda. And now it's like, no, get me a third Z. <laughs> I love that. Love it so much. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me on. Hey, thanks for doing it.